Look at this. This is the day after Christmas. We had so much rain yesterday that all of the snow, or virtually all of it, is totally gone. It looks like springtime out here. It actually feels like springtime a little bit. Less than a week ago, I was out here with the snowblower. Just had to document this. I'm on leveling it. I'm on leveling it. It is December 30th, 2020. The year is almost over. But I had to document this rare sight. I can't remember a Christmas season where we've been able to take down the Christmas lights in December. Usually they just stay frozen outside until March or April. Mm-hmm. So we, we have a little elf helping us. Yeah, we are taking advantage of a clear day. Yeah. And just like I documented on Christmas Day itself, there's hardly any snow left after that big rainstorm. We're supposed to get like a dusting of snow during New Year's, but I think it's going to be another one of those rainy, icy storms. Hard to believe just a couple of weeks ago, there was enough snow out here that Tegan was sledding down the hill in the yard. It was also super windy. Oh my gosh. There's a whole bunch more branches over here. More? We're just gonna have a couple of uh, tree trunks. Oh my goodness. I already cleaned up this yard once before the snow fell after the last windy day. Yeah. But look how many are there now. Yeah. There was like a huge branch, like right up against the house there the last time. Mm -hmm. But I got it all cleaned up and now there are more branches snapped off these trees. Poor trees. I also have to document it, but we also lost one of our birdhouses. These were here when we yeah. moved in, yeah. but obviously one of the posts was so old yeah. that it fell over, snapped and fell over. I'll go down and get a closer look at it. Keep up the good work, son. <laughs> uh, yeah, that one is chived. <laughs> I guess I should have vlogged it or taken pictures or something, but Tegan and I built two snowmen down here the other day. They even had little seashells for eyes and a carrot for a nose, and now they're totally 100% gone. And here's that birdhouse I was talking to you guys about. This post must have been here a long time. Actually, I think it was just a tree. I think that's a tree stump, not an actual post. Yeah, it broke right off. Yeah, these handmade birdhouses were all over the property when we moved in a few years ago. And I bet they've been here for years and years. I always just thought that was a post in the ground, but I think it was actually a tree, tree trunk. Whoa, careful. Whoa! You okay? Yeah. <laughs> you. But this birdhouse is okay. I wonder if anybody's living in there. Probably not. They probably have all moved out. You guys see anything in that hole? I bet lots of birds over the years have made their nests in here. I'm going to go right into the forest. Wait. I'm not going to yell again. No. <laughs> nope. Taking down the lights. Getting a little high. I'll... Oh, there they come. Thanks. I'm going to have to put the phone down in a minute. Hey, don't pull on him, don't pull on him. Hey, can you hold the phone and record me taking down the light? 
Oh, be careful, that is super icy right there. Stand on the ground. Um. What's that? <laughs> I'm recording the phone now. Me. So, um, wait, I gotta get it back. My mittens get on it a little bit. But Daddy is getting off the lights. If you can see, the part has upgraded. It's not bigger. It's now bigger. So, yeah. And... Mm. His face is getting a little really. So, yeah. And I is done. Almost. Almost. Mm. It goes around a little bit more. Why is this a so long light? Whoa. <laughs> okay. Daddy is now. <laughs> oh no, are they tangled in the branches? Um. Almost. There, I got him. Yay, bye. <laughs> eh, eh. We'll have to do something. Um, that is it okay if I hit the pause button? Yeah, you can turn it off. Taking down the wreath. How about you just put it in your little tractor over there and I'll take care of it in a minute. I haven't needed to use this guy in a couple of weeks, the snowblower. Yeah, I'll hang that up back in holiday decoration corner in a few minutes. Okay, don't step on my lights. What? Go help mom some more. Time to put away the blow molds. All of our lights are here on the uh, table or Hopefully taking gave them off. Hopefully everybody a good look at the lights all lit up. I did. Thanksgiving Okay, vlog. I'll take your word for it. So, and I took some footage out the kitchen window yeah. on Christmas morning itself. On the Thanksgiving Day vlog, I showed the backyard. So. <laughs> did you show where you ripped the awning? <laughs> yeah, oops. Knocking snow off of it? Um... <laughs> Well, you know, I just, I didn't think that we needed the bottom one since the top one broke last oh, okay. year. So I was, was just making it, was it all. It was intentional. Yeah, I was trying to match so that it was all good. Oh, bother. Time to put me away. This Pooh Bear has seen many Christmases. I'm sure he lived a full life of Christmases before we even bought him at the flea market about, I don't know, nine or ten years ago now. Don't scratch up poo. Poor poo bear. He's definitely faded. <coughs> and he has some cracks on his honey pot. See? He's had the crack. Eh. Time to put me away. Are you alive? <laughs> See you next Christmas, poo bear. So I mentioned it in a past vlog how next year I want to put all the pony ornaments on their own tree. So I've packed up all the po pony ornaments. This isn't like all of them. We also have some like ball shaped ones, but those will go with the other ball shaped ones. These weren't on a tree this year, but I was thinking, oh, these things would work as good uh, tree ornaments next year too. So I don't forget I put them away with the ornaments. I mean, they were just hanging around in the office area. It's like, well, this way I won't forget to do that next year. Okay. Tegan's little tree is almost all set. Now for the saddest part of Christmas, taking the ornaments off the tree.
And here's Ben in the office being a good American citizen. I think this is the earliest we've ever started taxes. <laughs> yeah. but, ben, but Ben's already uh, calculating out the 2020 taxes, which, you know, are, how, the, how are they looking? Um, we didn't spend much this year. No, no there's no travel. <laughs> we didn't really buy much for YouTube. We, so uh, so it's coming together pretty quickly. Yeah, we didn't uh we did not purchase that many tour review samples as you all know. And um we didn't go anywhere as you all know. So It was mostly your eBay business. Yeah, eBay was really where all of the money came and went. <laughs> so I guess that part's keeping me a little bit busy. And here is the afterwards. I don't think anybody's hiding in the branches, but usually somebody is trying to hide in there. It looks like we got them all on the big tree. I I use, I put the lights on different this year. Usually I go around and around and around. Yeah, I know it's this uh, year it's like up and down. Yeah. I saw that on TikTok. That it was easier, and then you don't waste lights on the back of the tree that no one can see. I did the same with the garland, too. <laughs> I, I didn't even notice, so. So, and then Tegan's little tree is ready to have the stuff taken off. There's still a few. We don't take anything off his tree. Oh, you just pl put I it just, downstairs like that? I just put it in the tote like that. Probably take I the take the star topper off. off, yeah. But I just plop it in the box. Yeah, like I know that. I still have a few generic ornaments mixed in the branches here but this one's almost done and then they're just the can't believe how many trees we have we have a lot of trees <laughs> <laughs> we didn't have a lot of ornament casualties this year but taking buzz off the tree he did take a tumble and his arm fell off and i think this is hilarious because now he's movie accurate <laughs> hi fellows He's movie accurate now. Because in the movie he lost his arm too. <laughs> yeah. It has been a multiple day slash week process. <laughs> but everything is coming down. Where's Nelly? Our forest is going away. Our house is looking very empty. Yeah. Well, probably not to them. <laughs> and here it is. The last storage tote full of Christmas lights and garland and stuff to bring downstairs to the, the cellar for another year. Well, I also have this wreath over here as well. But here it is. Now I just need to kind of mop the living room floor. Been put up some red lights for Valentine's Day, but you can see all of Christmas is taken down. Goodbye, Christmas. That's all for today. Oh, man.